Hello Zebra Herd and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 and today we are checking out yet another Rux Bling Pack. You might know that last month Rux Bling Pack 1 came out and included two different bling abilities that were sold by Rux previously but now you could pay money to get them if you have missed out on them. The same thing this time but with a little bit of a twist, there is a brand new never before seen ability in there as well, at least it's never been released by Rux before. So right now this is your only way to get it. So let's go ahead and check a look, take a look at that. Uh, it should be somewhere on here, right here. Uh, Rux Bling Bundle 2 is here. Stroll into the backyard battleground in supreme style with the Rux Bling Bundle 2, which contains Bling Gatling, Bling Pile and Call, and Outback Bonnet. And I think the Outback Bonnet is a new thing as well. I don't recognize that. Fa fa fa. Okay then. So, view the offer. We're going to go ahead and check out how much this is. If it's worth it or not, I'll let you guys know my thoughts by the time we buy it. But for now, let's take a look. I think this is gonna say the same thing. <laughs> it's actually a different picture this time. That's pretty cool. Uh, with Plants vs. Zombies going over for two Rex Bling Bundle 2, you can get immediate access to the rare abilities and items, including the Bling Co Bio Pylon Call and the Bling Gatling, which has never been released before by Rux. So that's pretty cool. $9.99, just like last month. So with all that being said, let's go ahead and check this out. Okay, so I just logged back on to Garden Warfare 2. That's always a suggestion I have. Once you purchase something like that, make sure you restart your game if you're not getting it. As you can see, we got it this time. Now that you've purchased, uh, now you've, now that you've purchasing the Rux Bling Bundle 2, it's time to r really, really shine. Head over to the sticker shop to snag your swag. Open gift, let's go ahead and see what it is. I am so excited for this though, because like I said before, it includes a new bling ability we haven't had the chance to purchase through Rux before, so that's very awesome. It's bound to release through Rux normally eventually. I know it's not this weekend. I already checked Rux because he is available normally this weekend. He's not selling anything too exciting from what I saw. But let's go ahead and check this out. We got the Rux Zombie Ability Pack, which should just be coins for me because I already have the, the bling pile on call. If you want to see a showcase of that, make sure you check the end of the video. I'll be sure to link it in the little end screen. And then that'll give me, give me 50,000 coins. When it comes to the Rux Plant Hero Pack, boom, we get ourselves first off the Outback Bonnet. It, which is a new legendary hat. I definitely don't have this one, so stay tuned for a showcase of this. Super excited for that. That's for the sunflower. And then the Rux plant ability pack. What will this have? Yep, it'll have that Blaine Gatling. Oh, I'm really, really excited. So stay tuned this weekend. I will check out this ability. Uh, definitely very soon, the next day or so, I'll try to get a video out of me just checking it out, seeing how it works and everything. I don't know if it'll be any different than our other Gatlings, but we already have two other Gatlings in the game, the P Gatling, the Retro Gatling, and now the Bling Gatling, which looks to be a variation of the Retro. So very interesting information for sure. And beyond that, like I said, I think it's very worth it if you're trying to get every ability, including the Bling ability, this may be worth it. Uh, we'll have to see how good or bad it could be because sometimes bling abilities do have different stats. The biggest example would be the bling cannon, not the bling cannon, but the bling barrel for the Captain Deadbeard. He has a better, better barrel with the bling than he does a normal barrel. So maybe this is gonna be the best Gatling yet. We'll find out in the upcoming episode coming this weekend. And beyond the other things, the pylon mech is pretty cool. It's not really that must have when it comes to its abilities, but if you like the look of a custom mech, it is definitely worth picking up. And then the new legendary hat is always very cool. You won't be getting any coins unless you already have, I guess, a blink pylon call. I don't think you could possibly have the other two things because there's no way you can get them through rocks or anything else at the moment. But that being said, if you like new stuff, you're gonna get guaranteed two new things here, and if you don't have the pylon call, you get at least three, so it can definitely be worth the money. If not, hold out. I'm sure that Rux will eventually sell these things in his shop. But those are my thoughts. I would love to hear yours. Let me know your thoughts on Rux Bling Bundle Pack thing too. <laughs> And let me know if you'd like to see a third one. Do you think this is something they should do every single month? Because like I said, we had one last month in May. Now it's June, we've had another. Could there be another one in July? I think that would actually be pretty cool if we get a Rux Bling Pundle. I can't pronounce it, that's a tongue twister right now. I don't know why. But anyways, with all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Bling so now you've watched at the end. Now you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. On the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.